I am Anil Kumar and now let us explore some patterns and correlate these patterns with place value. That is the objective of this video. Describe the following patterns and write the next three terms. Explain how these patterns are similar or different. So the first one is 1 over 1000, then we have 1 over 100, 1 over 10 and then you write three terms. The second one is 0 0.001 or 0 0.01 or you can say 0 and 1 0. So these are in decimal numbers. Now you have to complete these patterns and then describe them. So the first one is 1000th, 100th, 1 10th what comes next. So as we go from left to right, what are we trying to do? We are trying to multiply by 10, right? When I do times 10, I get 100 from 1000. And then again, I do times 10 to get 1 10th from 100. So the next number should be times 10 of 1 10th. That is 10 over 10. So what is 10 over 10? 10 over 10 is number 1, right? So 1 is 10 over 10, correct? Times 10, we get 1. And now it's simpler. So if we do again times 10, and again we do times 10, we get the number 10, and then we get number 100. So in this pattern, we get from 1,000th to 100th, 1,10th, 1's, 10's, and 100's. Does it remind you of place value chart? I hope it does. Next one is 0 0.001, 0 0.01, 0 0.1, 0. Now here again, as you have noticed, the pattern is similar. We are multiplying by 10 each time, correct? So as we move, we multiply by 10 each time. So if I multiply by 10 each time, the decimal moves one unit to the right and the number becomes bigger and bigger, right? This is 1000, same as that. 0 0.01 is same as 100. 0 0.1 is same as 1 tenth. The next number is, if I multiply 0 0.10 by 10, I get 1.0, right? Which is 1, same as 1, do you see that? And time tenths will give me 10 and then 100. So, the two patterns are actually very similar, right? They, you can say, is exactly similar. The only difference is that we started with fractions, correct? And here we have decimal equivalents. But both are equivalent, right? So, so these decimal numbers are equivalent to the fractions we started with. So when I say 1 tenth, it means 1 out of tenths. This is then 100th and that is 1000. Do you understand? So what we have here is kind of understanding of our place value chart. So in a place value chart, what we have is a decimal point somewhere. And to the right side of this decimal point, we have numbers which are 1 tenths one hundredths or one thousandths and so on and on the left side of this decimal we have ones tens hundreds and thousands right so on the left side we have ones right we have tens hundreds and thousands and so on so that is our place value chart and this pattern kind of gives us a look and understanding of place value chart. I hope that helps. Thank you.